PlayStation 5 and the Xbox Series X. At a glance, it looks like Microsoft has taken an early lead in terms of raw computing power. But is that enough? Do teraflops really make or break a console? Well, probably. But we're going to take a closer look at what both consoles have to offer and what PlayStation may need to do to take the lead in this upcoming war. Now that we have the spec release of the PS5, it's only natural that we want to compare them to the Series X. So let's do that, starting off with the newly announced PS5. Now, if you manage to actually sit through all of Sony's GDC presentation without false conference that Sony held 10.28 teraflops and 36 CUs. For memory, the PS5 clocked lower at one point. I sat and watched this video the other day, man, broke down all the little numbers the game and the specs and SSD cards and all this old extra shit for this um, Xbox Series X and, and PS5, man. But to be honest, I think I'm going to stick with the Xbox. And from the video I was watching, loading textures and data brings, the, CPU and the GPU Xbox was, a, was winning to me. Paper, but I'm going to rock with the Xbox, man. I'm going to do this video because I, I want to know. Which one y'all gonna get, man? The PS5 or the Xbox Series X? Because I got the X already. Now they got a fucking Series X. I mean, they ain't really changed the name much. But I watched the videos on it and did the, you know what I'm saying, the background check on both the systems. But lately, you know what I'm saying? Look, let me tell y'all when I stopped fucking with PS, PlayStation. Because I started off with PlayStation, nigga. Like, I had the first PlayStation. I was playing all the... I, we 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 was playing the Madden and shit back in the day, and all the Double Seven games, and you know what I'm saying, all that shit. We we was playing PlayStation first, but before PlayStation, I had a GameCast. But then I went to the PlayStation when the PlayStation came out, that shit was booming. Then PlayStation Two came out. You feel me? Still went no Xbox, and, and PlayStation um was um PlayStation Two was hard as fuck. You know what I'm saying? I've been rocking with PlayStation the whole time, bro. It, they whole roll, but once. Xbox One came out, you feel me? And the PlayStation 4 came out, because I had the PlayStation 3 too, but once the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One came out, man, Xbox seemed like they took over. I, I can't even front. It seemed like they took over, and um, I I've been fucking with Xbox ever since. It seemed like they graphics better. They graphics better, and I like how they control the fit in my hand, man. It's like a little wider or something, because the... The regular, the PlayStation controller just seemed a little small. I don't know why, but I like the Xbox controller. And, um, ever yeah, since then, to be honest, we all know we're going to get up and, and up a whole bunch of upgrades and, and graphics and all this extra shit, man, and load times and all that. We all know all that shit, man. That happens in every system. But my thing is the games. I fuck. Fuck the system. <laughs> I, I'm worried about the games, man. I want the games. Come on, man. Y'all need to come out with some hard ass games, bro. Like, I want to see a new fucking fight night. A new fight night, bro. Make it champion two or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you got to do. I want to see the new fight night, right? I want to see, like, you feel me? Um, What else? Sports game Madden, bro. That shit come out every year. A new Madden and I don't even play 2K no more. But new 2Ks and Maddens and shit come out every year. You know what I'm saying? Bring that duty out. Bring that Call of Duty out. Uh, I like that this new Mind Warfare they brought out last year. That motherfucker the shit. I still play that sometimes. Um, what else? When that Grand Theft Auto 6 come out, man. Because they, they read, I, play, I got the Red Dead Redemption 2. And the Red Dead Redemption 2, man. That, that's probably the, the hardest, like. Out of mechanics, Rockstar game they ever made, like story mode wise and all that shit. Red Dead Redemption 2, my shit, man. Um, what else? Bring out a new fucking. Yeah, like I said, bring out that new Grand Theft Auto 6, man. I want to see what they, you know what I'm saying, upgrade on that from the Grand Theft Auto 5. Grand Theft, Grand Theft Auto 5 had a lot of shit in it, so I want to see how they top that. And um, what else? A whole bunch of shit, man. Bring back some old shit that ain't been out in a long time. Bring back a 007. Bring back... Nah, you ain't got to bring back 007. We got Call of Duty. But... Bring some fucking... Uh, what else? I can't think off the top of my dome, but... My biggest worry is the games, man. I want to I wanna see what the games come out. 
You know what I'm saying? They finna go make me buy AK TV and shit and put that motherfucker in the basement. That's what I'm gonna do too. Give me one of them AK T <laughs> and get this motherfucking Xbox Series X. And they better bring them games out, man. Stop bullshit, man. Bring them games out. But y'all let me know which one y'all get it, bro. But y'all fuck with the PlayStation. Y'all still loyal to the PlayStation? Or y'all fucking with the Xbox Series X? But that's down my y'all.